Hey guys, it's Mike, your host of Crushing Your Fear. What kind of fears are coming up for you today? I got my book coming out soon. We address a lot of different topics in it. Um, I'm excited that it's done. We're talking to the publisher. We're going to launch uh, very soon. And I am psyched to get it out. It's called Crushing Your Fear, obviously. And uh, it's going to be awesome. So today, we're going to uh, talk about failure. And failure is not the opposite of success. It's part of it, right? So you have an idea. You want to do something. You want to create something, maybe start a business. Um, you have to try different things. If it's a new idea, nobody's done it before, you're like, I'm going to do this. So since nobody's done it before, you don't really have a roadmap. So you need to try different things. And you need to get on the right track. And, you know, 99.9 .9 out of 10, um, out of 100, sorry, if you uh, start something, it's probably not going to be the right direction. Or you're going to have to tweak it, right? Um, it won't go as you planned, but you have to look at it and don't call it a failure, right? Because it's not a failure. You're still in the game. You're still going. Um, you learn from it, right? It's a lesson. You learn from it. It didn't turn out the way you wanted. Okay. What you have to do is kind of revise your thinking, revise your um, strategy, and move in a different direction and see if that works. And if that doesn't work, okay, you learn from it, and then you pivot. Pivoting is, is key, right? We don't call them failures. We call it pivoting. We learn, and we pivot, and we go in another direction. And you're going to have setbacks, right? So it's going to be a setback, pivot, move in the right direction, setback, pivot, move in another direction until you find the right path. You know, when, as things start to stick and you see some progress, uh, so it's going to take some time and you're going to have to expect uh, these setbacks. It's just natural in everything that you do, anything that's new. You know, Thomas Edison, I think, tried to, you know, manufacture the light bulb and he did it like 9,999 times. And in the 10,000 time, it worked. You know, I don't know if that's the exact number, but that's the kind of the resolve that you got to have if you want to carry through with an idea. And, you know, you can only call it a failure if you quit, if you just stop, right? There's a saying out there, roads don't stop, people do. Roads don't stop, people do. And it's so true. You're going to be in a, in a, in a group of people, maybe have some competitors, maybe, you know, it's a new industry. Um, or if you're in an industry that's existing, too, you want to open a store, or, um, you know, an online store or whatever, you got to stay the course. Stay the course. It's going to be rough. You got to expect it, you know, if you want to do anything um, new. Say if you have a job uh, and you want to get out there and, you know, create a side hustle and, and just test an idea out, you know, it's not going to be easy. You're going to be up, you know, late at night doing things. You might not have a lot of sleep, but that's, that's the... Uh, it's par for the course, right? Stay the course. It's going to be rough and expect it. But you got to keep going. All those people around you are going to keep going with you, but a lot of them are going to fall off eventually because they're just going to give up. Uh, but in order to be successful, and you can ask any successful person, any person who's done something, uh, their lives have not been you know, some type of cakewalk where everything is handed to them. It just doesn't work that way. I mean, if you're wealthy, you can pass some, you know, wealth on to your kids and family wealth. Um, but that's not kind of earned. And a lot of that stuff kind of goes away eventually because, you know, they don't learn the lesson that their original, you know, family member did in order to, uh, you know, obtain that wealth and then keep it. Right. So you got to keep going, keep going, keep going. And if you do it long enough, you will succeed. So failure is not the opposite of success. It's part of it.
and we don't even want to call it failure, right? It's a setback, a learning lesson. We learn from it, and then we pivot and move forward in another direction and keep going. So don't fear the uh, failure, right? Move forward. Don't fail. That's what I got for you today. If you like it, please share it with somebody who needs it. Uh, subscribe to our podcast. Check me out, uh, crushingyourfear.com. Send me an email, michael at crushingyourfear.com if you have anything uh, you want to talk about. Uh, we're coming out with some courses. Um, people who want to uh, convert from a full-time job and working for somebody else and you know helping somebody else with their dreams to fulfilling their own dreams. Uh, we're going to call it Paycheck to Purpose. It will be coming out shortly, but the book will be coming out first. So grab the book, stay tuned, check out my website. I'll be posting stuff on uh, social media as well, Instagram, Facebook, and we're going to move forward. So I appreciate you. Thanks for listening, and we're going to talk to you soon. Take care.